Hello everyone. In this video, I am going to be showing you how to find a missing plugin in FL Studio. So if you're getting an error where you can't find the plugin you installed, this is going to uh, show you how to fix that. I'm going to start from the very beginning. So a fresh install of a plugin that I don't currently have just to make it easy. I'm going to be installing Valhalla Supermassive. It's a free plugin. It's for both Mac and Windows. So if you want to follow along, you can do that. I'm going to choose Windows and download that. All right, there it is. Then I'm going to go where it's downloaded, extract all, hit extract. And here is the program. Double click to run that, hit yes. And you can see these are all 64-bit plugins. You're going to want to run a 64-bit version of FL Studio to use these plugins. This goes for some other plugins as well. Accept. And then this is going to tell you where the, it is going to be installed. So our computer, program files, common files, VST2. Hit next. And then this is VST3 same place hit next and install all right so plugin is installed now the next step is we're going to go over to fl studio we're going to go to add and then manage plugins all right so here's all the plugins and you can see here plugin search paths this is where those paths have to be from earlier. And here they are right, right now. So you can see program files, common files, VST3. And that is exactly what we want. And here's VST2. So I already have these search paths in here. If you don't have them, you're going to want to click on this folder. And then you would go to wherever your install location is. So here's my C drive. All right. And then we have program files, common files, VST2, VST3. So these are where my plugins that I just installed are. That's where they're located and that's what needs to be imported here in the search paths. Otherwise they will not show up. Now I'm going to just click find installed plugins once I have the search paths here. All right, and you can see Valhalla Supermassive showed up right here. There it is again. So VST, you have different versions. There it is. VST3 plus VST, 64-bit. You can see some of these, like this one's 32 and 64, but looks like all of these are going to be 64-bit at this point. Now... If I want to use the plugin, I'll go to my mixer, choose a channel that I want to have it on, slot two, select. Let's go to more plugins. And there is Valhalla Supermassive, and I can click the star to add it as a favorite. Close out of there. Now if I click here, there it is, Valhalla Supermassive. So this, this whole menu is all your favorites. So if I go to more plugins, everything that's starred is going to show up when I hit slot two here and select. I like to be able to see all my plugins. That's why I have them all favorited. So that is how you install it. That's how you find it in FL Studio. If you have any questions, uh, let me know. Uh, leave a comment below and make sure to subscribe. I really appreciate it. I'll see you in the next one.